Okay, it appears I didn't have the mic on for the first seven or so minutes, so sorry about that. Goof up on my part. I'm Mr. Mingman Fan. Welcome to the stream. I'm battling this knight that I don't remember from playing it before on the Wii, but I'm gonna beat him. It's just a matter of time. I'm equipped with the Kratos armor from the Peace Corps exclusive character. Man, this guy really hits like a mud truck when he hits him. time there. Thought I could just phase my way through that battle, but it didn't quite work. Let's give it another shot. At least so far, I'm not losing any gold. I'm getting it all back after each battle, so... Not all bad. Slow, but it's like a ton. There we go. Got a nice little chain on there. actually doing better before I was using my face locket. I don't think it's really helping at all. Well, you know what? I think I need some better Iker. I'm gonna go all the way back to the village. Wait. Except half of my money is trapped in this battle, so actually forget that. I'm gonna finish this battle and get my money back. Hopefully going to the village didn't make it all disappear. I'm a freaking idiot. I wonder if I can do it without saving. Would it let me do that? Is there an option to do that? I can't believe I threw all, it, all of that gold by being, by trying to go back to the village. Dumb. 
This will be the Mr. Mega Man. I can't even talk tonight. This will be the Mr. Mega Man fan screws up. Let's play. I just pissed away a couple of thousand gold for no good reason. Now I feel redeemed. Finally had a... I wouldn't call it a flawless battle, but a good battle. Ha! I've been bested. But barely. You still need training to overcome what lies ahead. Farewell, Shovel Knight. Farewell to you, creepy dude. And Watcher Zombie says, Congratulations! Well, thank you. Now, what should I spend the loot that I just got from him on? I don't know. Oh, I accomplished a feat and earned a trophy. Well met. But you know what I've realized recently? Every time you get one of these trophies, PS4 blurs it out. It's some sort of privacy reason. Maybe they don't want people's personal information being displayed. I don't know. But... Nobody on the live stream gets to see it, unless I actually buy a capture card, put it outside of the PS4, and then stream through the capture card. Does it really seem worth it to do that just, just so I can show people trophies on the live stream? I don't know. I guess if I'm getting a capture card for other purposes, then I would go ahead and use it for that. Maybe I can get another meal ticket. I'm all out. Okay. Well, let's see if I can buy some more bottles for i -Core. Cause I definitely need more i -Core than the one I have right now. Mobile Gear Chaos Gear. I'm gonna go with the mobile gear because I know that comes in handy later. I believe one of the knights that I have yet to face, I'll definitely want that. Don't forget about those bragging. Oh, those bragging rights. Yeah, trophies for bragging rights. You know, sometimes this screen is a little hard to read. I have to actually look at the YouTube stream and read it there. It's the problem with these old projection HD TVs, they, they're a little fuzzy around the edges sometimes, and the chat happens to be right there on the edge. having the aid me. Yeah, I want to switch my Icor. I thought I could hold multiple Icors, but I'll settle for switching it to the one that I... Oh! And then he tells me I can't carry anymore. So wait, I gotta use the Icor I have. 
before I can even get... Why can't I just have more than one I-Core? Why can't I have an I-Core here, an I-Core here, an I-Core here, an I-Core here? I mean, it's not like in Zelda they make you hold only one potion when you capture a fairy. You can get multiple fairies in multiple bottles, so why can't I carry multiple I-Cores? I'm just bitching, I'm sorry, but it annoys me. It's annoying. Let's see. Did I do Polar Knight? I don't think I have. Like Invisible Walls, yeah. Nothing more fun in a game than Invisible Walls, right? When you try to go to an area and you just smack into something that's not even there. It is a major pet peeve of mine, too. You're right, zombie. Alright. I don't believe... I've done polar uh, Yeah, I did Clockwork Tower last time. So, let's do Polar Knight. What do you say? For shovelry! Steal thy shovel! Oof, it's slippery. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna be like one of those... Freaking Mario levels where you slide all over the place, and I can just tell now. Oh, and there's a bomb! Great, I look for a hidden wall, and it turns out to be a bomb. Not invisible walls, bomb walls! Yeah, I'm gonna slide around a lot, I can tell this right now. I'm gonna take the high road here. No pun intended. And hopefully I don't fall into a pit. With or without a pit. Oh! Treasure! That's nice. Rewards me for some good platforming. Oh, and we got these freaking wolves here. They just keep running and running and running, don't they? Can I just land on it once? Come on. There we go. A couple of piles of treasure to dig up. Yeah, you just gotta love ice cream, don't you? Oh, I'm risking it. Went all the way over there, but I got it. Oh, there was one more wolf. I didn't even see that one. Maybe he just started running after I moved over to the other side of the room. Maybe he was just lying in wait. Up this pile. Oh, guess there was a monster in the pile. It looked like something came running. I believe that happened in the Clockwork Tower too. Oh, there we go. Come on, where's the save point already? Give me one of those orbs. And why does this guy get a jump away from me? Come on, how fair is that? Die, you! Oh, and there's another one here. Okay, hope I don't go snippity dippity slide in here. Well, I guess that's a trade-off. The ice is blocking the shots. Now, it looks like there might be something here, so... I'm gonna go fishing for a second. I'm just going to use the throwing anchor to deal with this guy. Oh, it doesn't quite have the range I need. Yeah, they did that on purpose, didn't they? Alright, let's go with the phase locking instead. Oh! For the love of all chivalry, I cannot believe that. The wolf ran out. Oh, that makes me mad. Now I gotta go back and get all my stuff back. It wasn't even the ice that did me in. It was a freaking wolf. Not going to be that easy. You said it, zombie. This is not gonna be that easy. <sighs> I'm killing that wolf just to get some revenge. And 
next wolf that runs at me is getting it. You're getting it. Come here, you. All right. Onward! And then Viking looking dude, you're gonna get it. Everybody can get some. Okay, dude, you're seriously pissing me off here. He's got a helmet on, so I can't get him that way. Gotta remember, I can't bounce on their heads if they got that Viking helm on. Oh! Again with the cheapness there! Oh, this level is teaching me lessons. Lessons that I never wanted. Alright. We're gonna have to do this one stinking painful room at a time, aren't we? I'm gonna try the low road this time. Oh, and of course the wolf will still come down there anyway. Apparently that's just what wolves do. What does my faithful commenter say? Helm is mightier than the shovel. Yeah, zombie, it appears you're right about that. I'm just gonna skip this wolf. This one I'll kill. Why does this coward always jump back? Now I know why this armor was not the greatest armor to choose, because... I am not very impervious to damage here. Can I switch armor in mid-battle? Nope, it doesn't appear that I can. So, I'm just gonna have to try to not get hit as much. Can't do that. Bomb! Just what I wanted! Please tell me there's an orb in the next room. I'm gonna be very cross if there's not. Okay, there is. As long as I can get to it without dying. how I did it, I did it. Now I got a save point. And this guy freaking throwing ice at me. Some gold just isn't worth it. Since that gold is right on a pile of spikes, I'm gonna say not worth it. What are these things? Why do I have to deal with them? Looks like they're shielded on one side. Well, this would be the time to go back to the throwing anchor. That's effective. That's very effective. Thank you, throwing anchor. Alright, let's see how we deal with this particular situation. I bust my way down. Save points are best in platforms. Yeah, you said it, bro. That's why I'm glad they added them to Mario Maker, because, man, before they had save points or flag checkpoints or whatever you want to call it, holy crap! Okay, this is going to be interesting. 
Yeah, before they had the flag checkpoints in Mario Maker, some of those levels that people were designing were just super duper brutal. Okay, I think I'm kind of getting what they're driving at here. That worked out. Oh! Now we got these freaking guys again. Alright, so I gotta knock these down and then land on them. That's the game we're playing here. Do I want that gem in the middle? Is it really worth it? If I could just knock it down with my shovel, no problem, but it's not going to let me do that, so... And the bomb, of course. Why is there always a bomb in the wall in this particular stage? But I got another save point, so it's okay. Oh yeah, this is, this is the one that craps rainbows out. And the rainbows last a limited amount of time. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip those gems. Move right on to the next section. I got this freaking ice finger over here that I gotta deal with. further up I can get. It looks like it's blocked, so... Yep. Oh! I was out of hits! I didn't even realize my life was that low. Probably because there are no turkeys in the wall here. Oh, but I was already at the save point for this area, so... It works out, I guess. some of this stuff down. Alright, that's enough for it to get through, isn't it? I think so. Yep. Oh. Why did I start throwing anchors there? I didn't mean to. Say up. And now, oh, that's right. Helm protects him. I don't remember that stupid helm protects him. I want to switch from the uh, throwing anchors back to the phase locket so I can drop down and whoop this Viking's butt. There we go. Die, Viking, die. Vikings are getting on my nerves. <laughs> Finally! Some food! About time! And Lucina64 is back! Hey, what's up, Lucina? I haven't seen you since I did my last, uh... Session of Pac-Man 256. Here, I'm not going to let you do that without knocking down at least two of them. I wasn't sure what that was, but it turns out to be gems, so it's a good thing. Oh, oh boy! Maybe I shouldn't have tried to bounce on that thing's head when I was standing on blocks that I could fall all the way through. 
a little ill-considered on my part. Can I not kill this one by bouncing on its head? Nope, I guess I can't. So you know what? The heck with it. I'm not even going to go back and fish whatever's in there. I'm doing pretty good, Lucina. Nothing to complain about. Got a Saturday night with some free time, so I thought I'd do some streaming of Shovel Knight. Of course, I'm not going to be so free tomorrow night, and I have to cover fights tomorrow, but for now, I'm good. So I hope everybody's having a good weekend. I hope Zombie's having a good weekend, too. I hope anybody else that's watching the stream who's not chatting right now is also going to have a good weekend, having a good Friday night, and a good rest of your last weekend of July as we roll into August 2016 with whatever that may hold for us. This guy loves to toss stuff, but he doesn't love to come down into my hitbox. Oh. There we go. And bomb. Of course there's a bomb. Every wall has a bomb in this area. Clear the stage first and get the extras later. Yeah, I am... 10,000% in agreement on that. I am not going to worry about the extras at this point in the game. Especially when I'm wearing a very ill-advised set of armor. Uh, speaking of extras, I don't think I'll try that right now. Alright. Maybe... Throwing anchor again for this dude on the ladder. Yeah, that was helpful. And we got a couple of baddies to deal with here. But I got that shovel spark and I had full health, so let's just spark him to death. Come on. Come at me, bro. Come on. There we go. Lucina says, do you have the Shovel Knight Amiibo? Oh yeah, most definitely. In fact, it was one of my most anticipated Amiibos. If you go through some of my other videos on the channel, you'll see me lining up at Target the morning it was released looking for it, wondering where the heck it was and having to track down a store employee just so I could get it. Okay, go up, go up, go up, go up. Go up a little higher, go up a little higher, throw that anchor. Alright. Now I gotta time this right, because I gotta... I gotta slide my way across. Slide across. Slide across. Oh, no. Shoot, shoot, shoot! I couldn't even see where my sprite was. My sprite went invisible there. Okay, we'll just do it all again. Lucina. Nothing better than chatting with a YouTuber on a stream late at night. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Nothing better than having people watch while you play. Right. Come on. Drop your shield and get hit up by my shovel spark. Oh! Crap, I'm an idiot! I can't believe I fell for that. He knocked me backwards across the ice. Like a hockey skater in a brawl. I just got busted up. No bueno! I'm not going to make that mistake again. That's what live streams are all about. Word. Alright, this time I'm going to be aggressive. Be aggressive. Be aggressive. Heck yeah! You can knock me across the ice, I can knock you across the ice. You can play at that game. Here. We're on this freaking platform here. Okay. Come on, just a little bit higher. Just a little bit 
super high. Oh, okay. Kind of works, I guess. Now, can this thing just plow through the enemies? Can it destroy them when I hit it? Let's see. Oh, yeah, it can. That's very helpful. But being stuck on the ladder when I didn't want to be, not so helpful. I feel like I'm going to plummet to my doom once I try to jump back on the platform here. But first, Lucina says, I just made some new Smash Brothers and learned how to use an Elgato, but for zero cost. Well, dang, that's impressive. Wish I could do an Elgato for zero cost, but I'm just happy I landed on that platform. Oh boy, did they expect me to bounce off these dragons to get to the save platform over there? I think they do. Do I have the propeller? I have the dust knuckles, I have the mobile gear. I don't have the propeller. Yeah, this is a tough spot, but... Just gonna have to wing it. Literally. Okay, that wasn't really where I wanted to end up, but it's better than being dead, I suppose. Let's give this another try. I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. Oh, oh, yes! Woo! Sorry, that side of relief was a little loud, but... That was a lot trickier than I had counted on it being. Okay, I got the throwing anchor, so that's good. Take these guys out of my way. Mega Man had way worse day. Yeah, you're not kidding. I know. Okay, so I guess I go up and over. Yeah, that seems to be the ticket. Oh, the Elect Man stage on Mega Man 1 was way worse as far as platforming your way through something goes. That was brutal to the tall, because especially the very first area of Elect Man, those platforms you can't even jump from one to the other. They aren't staggered. They're straight on top of each other. So you gotta run past the last pixel to jump to the next one. It is just nuts. Alright. Whoa! Okay, that's almost unfair, but I guess maybe Mega Man was good practice for that, huh? All right. Tell me there's another save point coming up soon, please. Lucina, I used the replay option and signed into my account and recorded my replay, and hopefully that helps with my channel. Well, I hope it does too. I'm just figuring out what my strategy is here, so pardon me for a second while I mull over how to handle this. I think I'm going to need to go up, because it looks like I'm going to need those clouds to run across the ice, so... Let's first take out this freaking guy up here. Alright, that's a good start. Maybe this friggin' wolf over here. Two problems solved. Okay. Oh no, 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 And I got another freaking dive bombing dragon looking SOB over here, so. Lovely, just lovely. Alright, he's dead. Oh, and it respawned. So. Yeah. There was just no hope for getting rid of that dragon. I was just gonna have to deal with it. So, I'll work my way back. Watch 
to it respawn. Yeah, I know now. We gotta bounce off this dragon over here, grab the ladder over here. Get this freaking guy here. Grab the ice. We got the ladder here. Looking mofo there. Deal with this wolf here. Now I gotta try to get all my shoes back. Perhaps the phase locket might be more useful in this situation I'm in right now, so. message on my channel somewhere on the comments or whatever and I will do that. Hopefully I'm already set to both you guys. that account for my videos, but thanks, I will check out your channel. Alright, like I said guys, if I'm not already subbed to both of you, just leave a comment on this video or one of my other videos, I'll see it, and I'll make sure to subscribe, but if I already am, then it's all but good. to the boss already. I don't know. This feels kind of boss-like with this broken bridge here. But I would hope I would be able to get a, a turkey meal. Is there one up here on the wall or is it just another bomb? Okay, the presence of a turkey there tells me I'm just about due for a boss fight of some kind. Yep, here we go. Polar Knight. Huff. So, my old friend, the day has finally come. This will be our final duel. Should we not lay down our shovels and part as equals? Humph! The order has no equals. Surely you can recognize power. Join us. You've forgotten our oath. What happened to the proud warrior that I knew? Humph! No more words. The bitter cold will claim you. And Lucina says, Hence you're not sub to me, but it's 100% fine if you don't. No, it's cool. Lucina, you've been active in my streams, and I appreciate it. So, hey, at the very least, I want to check out your channel whether I sub or not. So please do direct me to it. Not while I'm playing, of course, but you know what I'm saying. Anyway, here we go. Polar Knight Battle! Okay. Dodging these crazy snowballs, so far that's not too bad. Oh, and then he flings them at you! And he can block with his shovel when I try to bounce on his head. And this armor sucks for hits. I need to switch back to the Kratos armor, because it has much higher hit damage reduction. I can barely take any hits with this armor on. 
But if at first you don't succeed, shovel, shovel again. better the second time. A little story about when I found my Shovel Knight amiibo. I was overly happy and got some strange looks. Well, you know what, Lucina? You probably couldn't get any stranger looks than I got when I found a Shovel Knight amiibo. Even though I already had one at this point, I was in a Best Buy in Irving, Texas. Took a little road trip to Texas earlier this year, and I found a Shovel Knight and immediately the first thing that popped into my head was Aaron and Dan, so I screamed, THE INFINITE DAGGER RETURNS! IT'S ANOTHER INFINITE DAGGER ADVENTURE! I believe I actually uploaded video of that, so you can bet anybody at Best Buy at the time was probably giving me a strange look as well, so I can relate. Freaking snowballs, buddy. Go! Oh. Right in the shops. Come on, I want my money back. I want my mons. Run over here. Ah! If I die without getting my money back, I'm gonna be even more sore than just dying. Alright, here we go. He had exactly the same amount of health. I goofed it up. Oh, Lucina was also in a Best Buy. Well, that's a good coincidence. You know, back when Amiibos were super duper hard to find, when you couldn't get things like a pit to save your life, Best Buy was, more often than not, other than Toys R Us, Best Buy seemed to have the best stocks. In fact, when the great restock of 2015 occurred and suddenly you could find Little Mac and a lot of the other rare ones all at once, my Best Buy had freaking tons of them. Of course, again, if you look through my videos, I think I took a reaction video when I found them at Best Buy one day and it was just like four to ceiling Little Macs in one display and I just about lost my mind just looking at that going, wow. Couldn't find a little Mac for a whole year, and suddenly there's like 20 of them right in front of me. I didn't quite know how to take that. I just lost some gold, didn't I? 
That only happens to me when I find ponies. Okay. I'm assuming we mean MLP by that. In which case, cool. I have a couple of those. I have a DJ Pwn3, aka Vinyl Scratch, so I'm down with that. And I bought an Octavia for my wife, because if you've seen the web cartoons, they're best buds, so I thought that was appropriate. And Octavia plays the cello, and so does my wife, so again, I'm very down with that. time in the battle, better or worse. Seems like I can get him to let his guard down, but only for a second. So close! I had him down to one hit. By the way, my name is Reed, but Lucina is my favorite character. Hey, no problem, Reed. Thanks for clarifying. Lucina was one of those super hard to find ones for a while too, but I got lucky with that because I lined up at Walmart, I believe it was. He's either Walmart or Target. No, I'm thinking this target, but I lined up way early that morning when they all came out that one day. And I got a Lucina and a Robin that way, so... Can't complain too much. I don't know why, it seemed, I seem to remember Walmart, though. Oh, you know what, maybe I pre-ordered Lucina from Walmart, but I still went and lined up at Target that morning anyway. Isn't that the same day the Splatoon Amiibos came out, or am I just completely out to lunch? It seems that way, though. I'm sure you'll tell me in the chat, Reed. Which, sadly, I cannot read in the middle of this battle. Ah, and I died again. Gotta go with what you love when it comes to online handles. Yes, you do. That's why I'm Mega Man fan. I feel like I'm getting a little closer every time, but not close enough. A spike right after I said that I'm dumb. D U M B. I'm not smart SMRT, I'm D U M B for that one. Also, getting a PS4 for the cost of. Oh, Reed is gonna make us wait. Fill in the blank. What's Watcher Zombie say? Hang in there, buddy. 25th times the charm, right? Oh, god, yes. I was, I'm getting so close with this battle, I can taste it. And it tastes like icicles. This guy's got freaking ice on the brain. I 
I am definitely switching out of this armor when I'm done with this battle, because this armor has no hit protection at all. Everything just damages me to no end. Every little hit you take. all up there up high. Reed is helping somebody move. Okay. That's noble of me. I'm glad I'm at a point in my life where I don't think I'm ever going to be moving again. Especially when I'm chilling, no pun intended, in a man cave right now, so I'm liking that whole scene. Scrolling, but I'm trying to make some progress in this battle here, so I'll catch up on it in a minute. Oh, the cheap hit there. But well, I'm getting some damage in, so maybe it's worth it. As long as I stay ahead on the hit ratio. Sorry if that was loud. Yes! Oh! That's a pretty sweet deal. You must be moving a lot of heavy stuff to be getting a PS4 in return. So, congratulations on that. But hey, congratulations to me as well, because I just beat the Polar Knight. Woohoo! Alright, guys. Lucina. AKA Reed and Watcher Zombie, AKA Watcher Zombie. I think I am going to call it quits with that success. I don't think I can really do any better than that. I beat a boss map encounter and I beat an actual boss in one of the stages. So that's a pretty good hour. Save my progress, open up some new areas of the map. And thank you, Reed. I appreciate that. Appreciate you guys tuning in for my live stream tonight. This has been really fun. But it's getting late. It's after midnight Eastern. It's after 11 Central. So I'm going to just call it here. But as always, you can check me out on Twitter at Mr. Mega Man Fan, M R M E G A M E N F A N, on Tumblr. MrMegamanFan.tumblr.com YouTube MMF187 And I'm out for tonight But read, watcher Hope I see you back here again in the near future Good night everybody <laughs>